the child. Come to me. I will take up your burdens, whisper my words into your soul, and alleviate the pain that feels endless. My love is limitless, my grace boundless. I am your refuge, a place of rest, your loving and faithful father whom you can trust completely. I am here, ready to forgive your past mistakes and rejuvenate your life. I am prepared to clear your path and open doors that were previously shut. It's good that you have left behind harmful habits, insincere friends, and nights of hollow joy. The old has passed. From this moment on, you are renewed in spirit. In an instant, you will witness how my power transforms your circumstances. But maintain your faith, for I am acting in your life in ways beyond your comprehension. Trust in me and my promises, for I am with you, leading you to triumph. New seasons of joy are on the horizon. You have nothing to fear, for I am here to support you and grant you peace at every step. You are familiar with me, and you understand that my love for you is without limits and everlasting. I am constantly by your side, guiding and safeguarding you and your family with my grace and wisdom. However, I ask you to engage as well. Spare a moment for me, if you feel it's appropriate, because I know that the time spent in my presence will mend your soul and fill your heart with the longing to stay close to me. The disorder and turmoil you witness in the world around you pale in comparison to the stability found in my embrace. Do not dread the future. The changes ahead will be beneficial, as I will transform all situations for your betterment. My sacrifice on the cross was to ensure you would not continue to suffer. I triumphantly rose, fully resurrected in glory. And just as that event astounded many, your heart now leaps with joy upon hearing my voice. I understand that doubts can invade your thoughts and bring distress to your heart, but solace lies in the truth. You are immersed in a unique journey of grace, forgiveness, love, and kindness. When you hear these words, feel my hand gently soothing your spirit. This is no illusion. I am your tangible and sovereign God. I communicate with you because I desire your closeness, urging you to open your Bible so that all my sacred promises can embed deeply in your heart. For my word is your sustenance and will bring abundant blessings. Yet, you must stay connected to this divine essence, to these heavenly messages, to the word that transforms your essence. A future filled with victory and abundance is yours if you maintain this connection. In moments of frailty, my strength will support you. In times of doubt, my light will lead you. The love I provide is eternal and unmatched, a guarantee of peace and joy that will never cease. Each morning, my mercy is renewed, and each evening, my peace will wrap around you offering comfort and tranquility. An assembly of my holy angels will continuously surround your home if you maintain a humble heart. My spirit will infuse every part of your being with hope and healing. My goodness and mercy will accompany you throughout your life, and you will reside in my presence eternally. Write down your prayers and needs, revisit this message, and embrace the strength I provide you each day. My love for you is everlasting. Affirm your belief in this. Do not be afraid or lose hope. Your aid and support are dispatched from heaven precisely when you need them, aligning perfectly with my divine timing. You will discover that placing your trust in me yields abundant blessings and marvelous outcomes. You are stepping into a season of celebration and joy. Today, I reassure you that I am with you, overseeing and directing you and your loved ones in all your endeavors, ensuring nothing disrupts your path. 
I am aware of your worries and understand your reasons for anxiety. You are human, and your challenges are significant. Yet the love and fidelity of your God who dwells within your heart surpass all. Present your burdens to me now, lay them at my feet, and watch as I transform your concerns into profound blessings through my promises and power. I have told you before, and I reiterate, I was, I am, and I will always be with you. I will never abandon you. You must be resolute, remember, you are incredibly courageous, and you must utilize all the gifts and tools I provide to conquer the challenges around you. You will prevail over the battles you face, you will dismantle the barriers before you, and through your adherence to my promises, you will expel every malevolent spirit attempting to pervade your home with sin and darkness. Rise and proclaim my word. Shatter the chains that bind those you cherish. Your faith empowers you to withstand the unseen spiritual forces. They fear me and will retreat as they witness you stand with valor and conviction. However, if you succumb to fear, if you lament your circumstances or express anger towards me when challenges emerge or when your needs are not met promptly, the forces of darkness will seize that vulnerability to confront you at your weakest moment. Fear not, but vigilantly guard your heart and saturate your mind with my holy and righteous word. Hold steadfastly to your faith and regardless of the circumstances or what you witness around you, never cease believing. Refrain from using your voice for doubt and grievances. Do not speak against this divine love that deeply cares for you and yearns for your companionship. Even in moments of weakness and failure, persist in your faith. For my forgiveness is yours if you approach me with a contrite heart and a will to renounce sin. No adversary can overpower you as long as you dwell under the canopy of my protection. Listen well, understand, and absorb this truth. I am your God, your Redeemer, the one who absolves your mistakes and purifies your spirit, the one who has triumphed over your accusers, the one who lifts you from despair and instills songs of praise in you. I am real, and you recognize this. Miraculous events unfold when you kneel and converse with me. I will sustain you through the tempests. Even as storms rage and assail, my love will shelter you, shielding you from the assailant's fury. You will never be a prisoner to despondency. And if in this instant you feel disheartened, if you struggle to find a reason to continue the fight, remember, there is always more, far more. Do not focus on the adversities inflicted by others. Do not release your hold on me, and do not be swayed by fear. There is no one in the cosmos who loves you as profoundly as I do, nor anyone else who can save you and deliver you from your transgressions, from the bitter and scornful assaults of false companions, from the indignities inflicted by your own kin. Today, they might assail you, they might attempt to dismantle your spirit, but I will elevate you amidst your kin. The day will soon arrive when they will acknowledge your worth and lament with regret for their actions against you, and you will extend forgiveness, just as I have forgiven. You will offer them love, yet you will wisely withhold your trust, protecting your heart within me. I will safeguard it securely and prevent any further harm from reaching you. Today is your day. Arise and look forward with faith, for countless blessings await you and your family. Yet I seek your commitment. Will you pursue me? Will you heed my commands? Will you let me guide your path? Will you permit me to use your voice to spread my word? and your hands to heal the suffering and liberate the oppressed. You possess the faith necessary for me to perform extraordinary miracles in your life. I trust in you, and you should approach my presence with assurance. 
Any good, pure, and uplifting request you make of me, I will fulfill. Today I inscribe in an open book that you and I have renewed our covenant, that you have chosen to serve and believe in me, and that I love you and will perform marvels in your life. This commitment is already secured by my sacrifice and resurrection. Now, the choice is yours to affirm it with devotion and love. My promise to you is steadfast and unbreakable. In this life, you are destined to succeed. With a humble heart and unyielding faith, you will conquer all adversities. I am your God. You are my champion, serving me wholeheartedly, and I will not let you fail. Today marks the end of your storm, and your period of trial concludes. My divine breath clears your skies, dispersing the clouds that once obscured my light. A new era begins for you. From this point forward, each step you take will lead you toward my blessings, so you may experience profound peace and immense joy. I listen to you with deep tenderness, and in quiet moments, I pause out of love, preferring to hear your voice. Your prayers are like a hymn of worship to me. Your tears will transform into joy, and your times of sorrow will turn to celebration. No longer will confusion cloud your thoughts. I will always be there, within your mind, infusing you with a beautiful and everlasting joy. Do not question my promises. When I vow something, it is because it is decreed, and it shall come to pass. You cannot fathom the lengths I will go to for your sake. My love extends beyond the boundaries of the cosmos. I will wrap you in warmth and bless your dwelling place. I will send my heavenly rains to nourish your fields, allowing you to harvest the fruits and savor them with thankfulness. Each morning, as the dawn breaks, my birds will serenade you, filling your awakening with joy as you recognize my blessings in every stride you take. Your life, along with your families, is about to transform. For the time to collect the rewards of your steadfastness and bravery is imminent. You have withstood the trial, maintaining your faith throughout. I have listened to your prayers, your praises, and even your grievances and supplications. Yet what truly touches my heart is when, amidst your tribulations, you express gratitude to me. It is profoundly moving when my children engage their faith, and even during exhausting conflicts, you raise your hands and earnestly declare, Beloved Father, I cherish you. This acknowledgement is all I desire. I know your words ring true. Your genuineness resonates with me, and you cannot mask your intentions. Your triumph is approaching. Hold fast and do not lose heart. Soon there will come days when you will not need to plead for anything. While others took their rest, you prayed and toiled. While others rejoiced, you shed tears. Now the time has arrived to harvest all that your faith and gratefulness have cultivated. It is time for the skies to open and release torrents of joy and bliss upon you. My desire to bless you is unwavering, independent of your emotions or how strongly you feel my presence. Even if discouragement and loneliness besiege you, leading you to feel forsaken, remember, I am constantly with you. I have always been and will forever be by your side, never succumb to despair. Reach out to me when you see darkness looming. Do not be swayed by the deceit of your adversaries. I cherish you, and you are mine. You are far more valuable to me than you could ever comprehend, and I will never abandon you. You have conquered numerous challenges and prevailed through dire circumstances by your faith and resolve. You have witnessed the transformation of the impossible into possible by steadfastly clinging to my word and my love. Now, consider this. Who can stand against you? I am the
the one who shapes your destiny, and it is my will for you to progress and claim your spiritual legacy here on Earth. I am who I am, your benevolent and fair God. You are a cherished member of my flock, a warrior I proudly call my child. I have instructed my angels to protect you, to bring you peace and shield you from illness and distress. You will be so enriched that you will rejoice at the multitude of blessings manifesting in your life. Remember, these blessings descend upon you from the heavens. Guard against pride in your heart. Stay humble, and I will bestow even greater blessings upon you. Your confidence will flourish, and you will notice it as you no longer hesitate before your adversaries. For I will stand with you, empowering you to triumph. You will see your foes withdraw, witnessing my power at work within you. Now is the moment for you to raise your head, to cast aside the grievances and wrongs of the past that you have endured without ever wavering in your faith in me. Look up. There's no need to gaze downward anymore. Do not miss all that I am eager to reveal to you. Lift your eyes and prepare to embrace the blessings I am ready to bestow, for I, your God, have chosen to fulfill my cherished promises to you. I am your God, the creator of all that is seen and unseen. Therefore, I assure you that I will forever stand by your side, lavishing upon you my most splendid blessings. My love for you spans eternity. Accept these words with faith and believe in them. Feel my presence as you listen, as you read. Inhale deeply this moment, savor its essence and revel in this encounter. There is joy, happiness, and peace to be found in prayer. Emotions that are yours to cherish always. I am life in its fullest, and I am infusing every part of your being, your body, your soul, and your mind, with health and freedom. I am filling you with my Holy Spirit. I am sweeping through every corner of your thoughts, clearing away the sadness, the buried pains, the regrets, and the unresolved errors. Today marks their conclusion. Please accept this forgiveness. Rejoice in the purification I am bringing to your heart. From this day forward, your tears will be of joy, happiness, and sheer delight. Stretch your hands towards the heavens and welcome the downpour of blessings raining down upon you and your family. Let this sacred water soak your hair. Let your garments become heavy with its weight. But carry no further burdens of sorrow or vanity on your shoulders. I am bestowing upon you my matchless glory, which ushers in profound change and transformation. This is the moment you have long anticipated, and that I have eagerly awaited. For it was time to rewrite your narrative, to heal your past, and to restore what was lost. It's time to rejuvenate your life, and reaffirm your belief in the promises I have made in my word. From today onwards, you will undergo such a profound transformation that you will scarcely recognize yourself. The enemy, the devourer, will not dare approach you. People will notice something distinctly different and extraordinary about you, while the wicked will perceive the power you carry within. Some may despise and fear you, aware that their time is limited and their downfall imminent. You and your family are destined for victory, whereas those who have assailed you with hostility will face defeat and will not recover. I am imbuing you with my Holy Spirit, filling you as one would fill a vessel with pure, healing oil, cradled gently in my hands. I bestow this immense blessing upon you, urging you to contemplate the incredible achievements you are poised to realize. Envision the numerous lives you will touch, the blessings you will bring to your family, and the many you will deliver from despair, illness, and even death. You will be their liberator. New friendships await you, and today your character will radiate joy and contentment. You will gain favor with righteous people who will share their blessings with you. 
I encourage you to speak boldly, declaring who it is that empowers and loves you profoundly. Speak with authority, and your words will be a wellspring of life and hope. You will remain steadfast in your devotion to me. You will never lose sight of the sign I have given you, the forgiveness of your sins, my blood shed for you, which purifies and grants you eternal life. I will take pride in being your father, and you will delight in the gifts and miracles you receive from me. Your offspring will be blessed, and as numerous as the grains of sand on the shore. I am the same God, who loved and showed you mercy in the past, and my love for you deepens with each passing day. Your future rests securely in my hands, but your faith is essential. Once more, I urge you not to overlook this message, not to dismiss this channel through which I am speaking to you. I have selected the humble of heart to carry my word across the globe and to proclaim these three beautiful divine words. God is good. I have always been, I am now, and I will forever be for you a manifestation of love, kindness, and mercy. I embody goodness, for I am also the author and creator of faith. By my word, the universe was called into existence. With my wisdom, I set the boundaries of the stars, the galaxies, and all the elements essential for sustaining life. You were formed from the dust, and to the dust, your body shall one day return, while your spirit patiently awaits by my side for the final resurrection. I will transform your mortal body into an eternal, holy, and indestructible form. You will join my faithful servants, and together, we will return to this earth to confront the armies of evil. Prepare yourself, for you are destined to reign with me. But until that time comes, never cease to pray. Persistently seek me. I desire your commitment to fulfill my will. Declare now, in your own words, your everlasting love for me. This is the cherished moment I have been anticipating. When I speak, you listen. I express my profound love for you, and you feel its depth. I demonstrate my unending presence in your life, day and night, in joy and in trials. When challenges arise, I am there, overseeing your needs, drawing your attention with gestures of love, breathing my divine essence into your existence, and instilling peace amidst your struggles. No matter where you are, you will find me there. This moment, when you call out to me and I answer, is as significant to me as it is to you. I send the sun to brighten your mornings, and the breeze to refresh your dawns. My love envelops you with divine warmth, empowering you to walk with assurance, turning your path of suffering into a journey of purpose. Trust in my eternal promise that nothing and no one can ever remove you from my grasp. I am acutely aware of the hardships you faced, your present circumstances, and your past. Today I urge you to stand firm in my promises. Acknowledge that you are still standing, because I love you, and you are mine. Do not let your sight or sensations lead you astray from me. Today, I choose to reaffirm my presence in your life, and remind you of the promises that guide you toward verdant pastures and tranquil waters. Let all doubt flee from your heart. Banish fear and anxiety. I am transforming your home, your future, your character, your dreams, and your aspirations. Trust in me and allow me to work in you. Let me lead you and teach you new paths. Approach me boldly, without fear. I await you with open arms, ready to embrace you. I yearn to relieve your burdens and cleanse away the negative emotions that are draining your vitality with my boundless love. Cease your struggle against the overwhelming currents. Stop relying solely on your own strength. Submerge yourself in the river of my spirit and find tranquility. Extend your hand to me. 
no harm will befall you. Even if it feels like you're plunging deep into your troubles, I will reach out and lift you up. You will not be overcome, nor will anyone cause you to falter. I will protect you and rescue you from those who conspire against you. I desire your life to overflow with joy and love so profound that it becomes evident to all. You will receive all that your heart has desired, and the world will recognize you as my cherished child. Allow me the privilege of guiding you from the darkness that surrounds you into paths of peace, away from the worldly burdens. If I remind you of my promises today, it is because of my love for you, as I wish nothing but the best for you. It is time for you to cast aside the sources of your discouragement, to tread the paths I have laid out for you, and to reclaim all that was taken from you. Recall that I sacrificed my life on the cross for you and rose again mightily to demonstrate my power to the world and affirm that nothing is beyond my reach. Steer clear of those who aim to lead you astray and inflict harm. They seek to deprive you of the blessings I have planned for you. They desire to see you defeated, devoid of peace, purpose and zest for life. However, in my presence they cannot make you stumble. I will be with you, guarding and loving you eternally. Once you decide to follow me with conviction and resolve, nothing and no one will be able to separate you from my love. Your past, your sins, your mistakes, they will no longer define you, for I have forgiven you, and there is no longer anything for you to regret. You are a new creation. My blood has cleansed you and shattered the chains that bound you. You are liberated from all malevolence. Do not dwell on the past or search for what I have already put behind us. Embrace the new present I have gifted you, free from guilt and fear. I encourage you to start each day with prayer, blessing your morning and setting the tone for your day. Should you feel weak or frightened at any moment, trust that I am there to rejuvenate your faith, strength, and hope. When challenges arise, confide in me. I am here to assist you in finding solutions and revealing the answers you need to persevere. My love for you is boundless and everlasting, enveloping you even now. With my might, I obliterate every curse, illness, pain, and chain that binds you to misery and scarcity. Whatever your needs, I am here to support you. Do not fret over your finances. Your life rests securely in my hands, and I assure you that you will advance victoriously, blessed abundantly. Find peace, direct your attention toward me, and let the serenity of my love fill you. Do not disregard my voice or continue living unaffected. Listen closely, for I speak a vital truth. Your soul is in distress. While unseen by others, you and I are aware of this reality, and that is what truly matters. I have a purpose for your life and your family's future. Every loved one holds a special place in my heart, chosen to achieve greatness and destined to receive abundant blessings. Beginning with you, I am kindling a light within your heart, and this light will serve as a beacon guiding the way for others. You will stand as a testament to what my power and my word can achieve in a receptive heart, one that proudly acknowledges me and persists against all odds, battling tirelessly, never yielding to the obstacles that lie ahead. You will safeguard your home from all malice. No discord, no animosity, no harsh words shall enter. Do not welcome those who disrupt families with deceitful smiles into your home. Though you live in a world filled with trials, I command you to place your complete trust in me. I have conquered the world, and you too shall overcome the challenges you face. Your family and you will rise, and your names will be celebrated among the nations. Your lives will stand as a testament to miracles, power, love, and redemption. I earn
earnestly yearn to reveal my divine presence in your heart, in your home, in your workplace, and in your dreams. I aim to help you align your desires and prioritize correctly. You are aware that material things should not hold the greatest importance. Thieves may covet them, and in their greed, they might even threaten your safety. Yet I am your protector. However, you must also choose wisely. I open paths for you, but you must advance through them with my word, guiding your thoughts and your heart steeped in faith. I wish to bestow abundant blessings upon you. I will lead you to distant places, but remain focused. Never lose sight of what truly matters. Always prioritize your relationship with me above all else. Steer clear of those who insist you forsake me for their companionship. It is crucial to shield your heart from such influences. Your family is also important, despite any hurt or mistakes they might have caused. They may have disrupted the sanctity of your home and brought disgrace, but their souls are still precious to me. You will serve as my conduit to extend them mercy, forgiveness, and patience. Entrust your days to me. Bring your family before me in prayer and persist without wavering. Continue to intercede for them, for every day is sacred to me, and I attentively listen to your prayers. I will fulfill your requests. I will respond to your supplications. I will transform the hearts of those you love. I will eradicate scarcity from your lives, and you will all thrive in love, peace, harmony, and abundance. I seek your loyalty. I demand persistence. I require steadfastness in prayer, vibrant faith, and ample patience. It is my desire that your heart remains untainted, void of violence. Let no falsehood slip from the lips that praise me. My power actively works in your life and will surely manifest. My word and my love are serious commitments not to be taken lightly. Many delude themselves thinking their lavish offerings impress me, but I do not align with those who claim holiness yet harm others with their deeds and words. If you encounter such individuals, do not emulate them or share in their ways. Keep your heart devoid of malice or judgment. Refrain from pointing fingers or passing judgment on others to avoid being judged yourself. Treat all with love and patience as you would like to be treated. I challenge you to adhere to these commandments you've just heard. If you do, I will swiftly bring about extraordinary and unexpected miracles in your life. You must withstand the assaults of your adversaries through your adherence to my commands. Let my word be etched deeply into your soul, serving as a shield against conflict. You will experience my divine touch upon your spirit, and your body will be rejuvenated with healing and renewed vigor. Your heart will open to a supernatural realm where visions and dreams become your reality. I have chosen you for a unique and mighty purpose. You are not a mere product of chance. I cradle you in my arms and guide your every step. You are stepping into a new era filled with abundant blessings. Affirm your belief in this promise. Rely on me and cast aside your fears. I am here to hold you and bring peace amid your struggles, demonstrating that I am indeed with you. Not long ago, you called out to me in your desperation, and I have been attentively listening, waiting for the ideal moment for my Holy Spirit to whisper to your heart. I am fully aware of your actions and your journey, even when you feel lost and enveloped in darkness. But such is my love for you, that I refuse to let you succumb to failure or defeat. You will not fall, even as the world around you appears to collapse. Beyond the barriers blocking your path lie tremendous blessings and divine gifts. I grant you the wisdom to unlock every closed door and surmount every obstacle. 
from this day forward, no one will threaten, shame, or scorn you. Your Heavenly Father, the Creator of all, stands with you. Fear no person. Remember how often those jealous of you have conspired against you. They have lied, plotted, and tried to bring you down. Yet all their schemes have come to naught. And here you are, still standing. Today I am instilling in your heart new desires to embrace life. You are infused with a renewed joy that no one can take from you. I hold you securely in my hands, for your deep love has captured my heart. You have maintained your faith and followed my word. Upon you and your family, I will lavish my favor. Trust in me with unwavering fervor and simplicity, for your future rests securely in my hands, and I am your shield against all who seek your harm. No one will bring you shame. It is decreed that the light of my Holy Spirit will illuminate your path, and because you have sought my assistance, those who have pursued you unjustly will find themselves estranged from my mercy and will falter by their own actions. Their deceitful words will be silenced for eternity. But you, like a robust tree, nourished by streams of blessings, will thrive and prosper. You and your family will yield abundant fruit, serving as a beacon for other families who will look to your example and be inspired. Upon each generation of yours, I will lavish my goodness, and I will envelop them with my presence. Seek me each morning and resist the distractions that the world presents, lest you forget the source of your blessings. Our bond is forged through my grace and sacrifice, your allegiance and faith, the power of my resurrection, and your resolute choice to believe in me, despite having not seen me. Yet I will manifest myself to you in supernatural ways, ensuring that the profound sense of my presence you experience today will be everlasting. You wield the very power that fashioned the cosmos. I have affirmed repeatedly, and I reiterate, I am with you. You will not falter under any circumstance, nor will you yield to the assaults of your adversaries. You will not permit anyone to belittle your value. You will reject violence and safeguard your children from any harm. Be wary of those who use charming words and pleasant smiles to gain access to your home, only to undermine it from within. I have stationed angels around you to thwart the hand of the destroyer. But you must also play your role. Demonstrate your faith and embrace these words. Your adversary prowls like a roaring lion, waiting for a moment of forgetfulness or distraction on your part to pounce and devastate your faith. Start each day by setting aside a few minutes just for me. Approach me with gratitude, acknowledging that each blessing in your life stems from my deep love for you. I have repeatedly called for your heart. Don't withhold it any longer. Surrender it to me now completely and without reservation. I forgive your errors, clear your guilt, and refresh your conscience. I inscribe my word upon your soul, bolster your faith, and empower you with the courage to live obediently and devotedly in prayer. If you entrust your heart to me, you will realize your grandest dreams. But if you stray from this sacred love, you risk reverting to the past I have already wiped clean. Here, true love awaits you, a love so genuine and profound. Though you may not fully grasp it yet, soon you will see with your own eyes how I safeguard those I cherish. You are immensely valuable to me, and I am prepared to accomplish the seemingly impossible for you. Be assured that my words to you today are clear. I have a divine plan for both you and your family. Let me remind you once more. If you feel the urge to weep, go ahead and cry. I will use those tears to purify your soul of everything that burdens you currently. Be calm, focus on me. Listen intently to my voice. 
the words I speak encompass your life, your future, and your blessings. I will never disappoint you. Even when others reject or misunderstand you, I stand by you. I will not allow your adversaries to prevail, and I will continually direct your path. You are my treasured child, and nothing can sever you from my love. Reflect on this truth. Look upward, for your assistance originates from me. My spirit is cascading upon you even now. In the stillness with me, you will find fortitude, and amidst chaos, you will discover serenity. I am your sanctuary and your might. You are not alone in facing these challenges. I accompany you through every low and elevate you on every peak. As you invoke my name, you'll find your burdens alleviated, your heart liberated, and your mind clarified. I am waging your battles, and victory is assured because I am the Lord of hosts. Trust in me, and together we will overcome all obstacles. You are loved, chosen, and victorious. My blessings will continuously pour into your life, for you are destined for greatness, and no earthly power can halt what I have initiated. Rest now in peace, my beloved, knowing that I am with you 